Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. In this video, we will see the practical implementation of the Git reset. So, where in the real world we will be using the Git reset. Now, here I am creating a project. Okay, so let's try to create mkdir git reset. Okay, so I am creating a project and let's go into the project git, git reset. So, I am I went into the project. Now, what I will try to do, let's initialize the project git init. So initialize the project we are in the master branch let's assume that we are in the master branch so now i will create va index.txt file so i am creating a new file va.index.txt file so let me close this one so now let me add into the st staging area and commit hyphen m so add index file okay so this is the commit i have made so if you want to check you can check something like git log hyphen hyphen one line so now we have we are able to check the commit so we have added an index file now fine it's fine now what i want to do is so i uh, uh, so now let's me clear out this one so now what i do want to do is so i will i am trying to work in some feature okay so let's think of i am working in a feature so let's go so let's try to implement so i am implementing in the master branch only let's see you remember so now feature.txt so i have created a file so just i want to stop so i have move, i am moving this one so i am committing something like so here git commit hyphen m so now sorry git commit hyphen m i can write something like create feature okay create feature file so we have created a creature feature file now if i try to check git hyphen hyphen log one line so now another another commit is there and the head is also there at the create feature file okay fine so now again the next day the very next day i came and again i have started working on this feature file only so what i will try to do so just i will try to open this feature file and i will try to do hello so i am working on the so lila web dev so we are working on this feature file okay so now let's try to add it so at the end of the day what i will try to do sorry at the end of the day what i will try to do i will try to add it to the staging area and i will commit the work what i have did so now so now working working on the so working on the feature okay so working on the feature so now after working these all the things so now if i try to check this one so i knew i came to realize that so i uh, so now i am in the commits so i came to realize that so this feature is not necessary right now so this feature is not going to be live so this feature we don't want to imp work on this feature so what or otherwise whatever the feature up to now i have worked the logic everything is wrong so i want to implement in a nice manner so what we need to do so now how can i implement so already the feature file is there so what one thing what we need to do is so we need to go everywhere and we need to delete the thing what we have implemented the feature that will be a tedious thing so now we we know that up to here the add index file so this is the place where we don't we didn't implement the feature the right next commit from here onwards we have implemented the feature so now if we move this master or master or head to this commit so then it will be very easy so that feature will be removed and from here onwards i can create a i can i can do the logic again with the new logic so for that feature so now what how can i move this one so we know that how to move the head but the master will not be moved so we know that how to move the he uh, head um, a branch so we can move the branch using git reset so what i can do here git reset so what i can do here so this is the common sorry so now i can do git reset sorry git reset so i can paste it here so i can paste it here so if i before before doing this one what we can check we will check the status so everything is clean okay nothing is there so now what i will try to do git reset and now i can paste this one so now what i want to do so i want these files and also these files so why because if you try to type the ls here so feature.txt file is still there so now if i try to do git reset <coughs> git reset so what we can do so the the commit name yeah here if i do here like this so git reset had it has been moved so now it has been moved so now if i try to check git log hyphen hyphen one line okay we are able to see that the two two commits has been removed 
and if I try to see the status but still the feature.txt file is there right so what we what can we do here so I can do something like instead of using this one git reset we need to do the hard so that the everything will be removed so now if I so why, why because if you do the ls still the feature.txt file is there present in the working area but we have took the uh, commit so but the commit has been moved here so if I try to check here sorry git log hyphen hyphen so the uh, feature commits what I have did everything the commits has been removed but the still the feature file is there so for that reason what we need to do here we need to do git reset hyphen hyphen hard so if we move the hard then head also has been moved head is now at this one and index file so now here what it will try to do so if I try to check the ls so now still it is there so why because we are we, we have already moved this one so now what we can do so git reset so if I check the check the status so here still the feature file is there why because we have already set this one so now if I want to move this one so now what I can do here so let's let us commit okay so git add this one okay git commit hyphen m feature file added okay so now I, have, I am adding this one again so now let's try to check the git log hyphen hyphen one line so now here the head is at here now I want to move the head to before this 301992b so now let's copy this one and now what I will try to do git reset okay copy this one sorry paste this one and here hyphen hyphen hard if you give this one so now head is now at this one so now if I try to check the status so nothing is there in the branch so previously we got the feature if you do the soft thing so now nothing is there if I do the ls so nothing is there so everything has been gone so now if you if you keep the hard thing so in the staging area also the repository files will not be there so everything will be clean okay so now if you do the hard thing means so everything is repository everything will be coming into the staging area and the index area so you need to remember this one so this is how we will be doing so if I want to move the branch from one commit to another commit we will be doing like this and another scenarios where we will be doing this one so now I will I will explain you for example see here what I will try to do is so here ls if I try to do yeah okay so I am having git in, via index.txt file okay so hello Leela so I have written something like this and I am saving so now if I try to do here so git status okay so it is in the working area still it is in unmodified state okay unstaged so now we need to move it to stage, staging area so now how can I move so git add I move it to the staging area so now git status so here you have you can see that in order to move this one again to the working area from unstaging area to the working area you can use git restore hyphen hyphen staged restyling so but we can also use the reset command to move the, to remove, remove the what we can say to remove the files from the staging area what is that option that is nothing but the mixer option so if you have the mixer option whatever the files present in the repository it will be moved to the staging area not to the working area so now what I can do here git reset I can use the head and I can use the hyphen hyphen mix or otherwise if you don't use also not a problem so if I do leave this one so what will happen see so now unstaged it has moved index.txt has moved to the unstaged so now if you try to check the status see now it is in the modified stage so it is in the working area previously it was in the staging area now it was in the working area now you need to understand that reset can also be used to move the files from staging area to the working area also now I want to remove this from the working area also what I can do here so git reset head hyphen hyphen hard I can use the hard so that the stage uh, stage files whatever the thing it is present and also here that whatever it is present everything will be removed for example see now I will add it to the staging area here okay so now if I try to check the status so it is in the staging area now again I am trying to change this one okay so hello what I can do here Leela web dev so I am saving this one so saved now if I try to check the status the same index.txt it is in the staging area and also it is in the working area now I want to remove these all the files okay from both in the staging area and also in the working area I want to get the update files whatever the current files it is present in the head so what I can do here git reset head hyphen hyphen hard so if I do the hard now head has moved to the recent commit and also the files has been removed from the staging area and also in the working area if you try to check the status see 
Now what will happen? See everything is clean, branch master is everything is clean. Okay, so now if I try to check the VA index.txt file, so now nothing is there. So hello Leela, everything, nothing is there. So this is how also we will be using the reset command. So you need to understand that if you want to move a particular branch or omit the particular commits, means you can use this git reset or otherwise if you want to remove the uh, changes present in the staging area also, you can use the git reset mixed, uh, mixed option and if you want to remove the files, uh, ch change the files both in the staging area and also in the working area means you can use the git reset hyphen hyphen hard. Hyphen hyphen soft means it will not remove any data from the staging area or unstaging area. Just it will move the commit. Okay, move to the particular commit. So this is the all about the git reset command. Hope, hope you understood about this git reset command. So if you have any doubts or any suggestions, please post the comments below to this video. And if you like this video, please do support me by subscribing to my channel. Thank you.